Cuban boxer Namibia Flores doesn't pull her punches. A lone woman in a man's world, she has squared off against male fighters for years. But as the 39-year-old approaches retirement age, her country is still deciding whether to recognize female boxing as a sport. I would love it if they recognize women's boxing, because that will show Cuban women that we are free, we can do whatever we want and show that women can do the same as men. Flores learned Taekwondo as a teenager before moving on to boxing as an adult. Women's boxing first featured at the London Olympics in 2012. Cuba has cleared women to compete in weightlifting and wrestling, but boxing has yet to break through on the communist island. So Flores has spent the past decade training with male counterparts, often getting the better of her opponents. She's ready to fight. Put her in the ring against a man of similar weight and maybe in the end he will have an advantage. But she will fight just as hard. Flores' story has drawn international attention with a documentary on her life screened in the U.S. this year. But she has turned down various offers to leave home and compete professionally under a different flag. Why would I go to the United States to box there and, for example, win the Olympics for them if I learn how to box here? The dream of winning an Olympic gold is quickly fading. It may be too late for her, but she has found a new goal to form and train a women's boxing team and pass on the torch to others. <laughs>